Hi, this is Cars from OneTap. The attendance tracker by OneTap is a free add-on by OneTap that makes it really easy to keep track of attendance on Google Sheets. So essentially, when you start off with Google Sheets, you're just given an empty file and there's no like structure, format, or, in or like a template here that makes it easy for you to keep track of, for example, an attendance in a classroom, right? So what we're going to do here is we're going to create a new sheet called math class and we're going to run the add-on to help us create a pre-populated template for a sign-in sheet and also help us pre-populate pre, uh, pre the data for absence, presence, and different categories and, um, and, then, and then essentially take attendance manually using the add-on. So what we'll do is we'll go over here to extensions and you can find one, attendance tracker by one tap here or you can click on one tap on the sidebar. Once you've done that, um, you will be asked for permissions if this is the first time that you're running it. So the permissions would look something like this. There's no data that's being transferred over to OneTap. Um, it, the the add-on simply just accesses the data that's on the Google Sheets and runs everything locally. So for starters, what we'll do is we'll create a pre-filled template. So that means like pre-populating the headers for a certain date range. So you can go over here and you can do custom date range if you just wanted to, for example, do attendance from the 15th, January 15th, which is today, all the way to the to the end of January, or you can do the entire month here. I'm gonna do the entire month. And what you'll notice is that the Excel file gets these headers pre-populated in them. So like the different days of the week, and then we have the like the actual day, like the weekday, and then we have the we have the different, um, yeah, we have the different summary columns here, such as absent, presence, leave, and the holiday. So these are going to be the summaries of like the total count of uh, the like the total count of the number of times the student was present inside of the state range. So what we'll do now is we'll go ahead and add some names. And then once you've added in the names, what you'll do is you'll go over here and then you'll do auto mark attendance. So we'll go ahead and mark everyone present Monday through Friday. And then what we'll do is we'll do Saturday and Sunday as a week off and we'll set the background color so that it's easy for us to see all this data. And then the Google Sheets will, uh, well, the Google Sheets add on, we'll go ahead and mark the attendance. Uh, what we'll see here is that like everyone's been marked present based on our, based on our rules that we specified. And uh, there is already a summary here for the number of times, for example, Carlos was present, which is 23, and everything else is like zeros. Now what we'll do is we will, or except for week off, which is gonna be eight because of the weekends. Now what we'll do is we'll go ahead and take attendance manually. So let's say, for example, I know that Carlos was absent on Friday. So this right here will give us 90% of the data, right? Because most people were present most of the time. Now we can go in here and we can <clears throat> and we can go into specific people and we can say that, hey, I remember John was not there, like he was on a leave on Monday. And we know that, for example, Deanna um, on like on the 15th today, she is absent. So as simple as that, well, what you'll see is you'll start to see the numbers change over here, like the, like the summary columns, and we'll see that like uh, it, it's gonna show that uh, Deanna was absent one time, and then so was uh, Carlos, and then we can also see that over here, we can also see that um, John was on a leave, and that will be indicated on this column right here. So that's pretty much it. The one tap attendance tracker makes it really easy to create a pre-populated sign-in sheet template, uh, be able to auto mark attendance so that you don't have to do this manually, and then gives you certain action buttons such as the manual marking of attendance. So our goal here is to make the attendance process much more simple for classes, for universities, for schools, and to give you guys a structured format which can make everything simpler and easier.